Quite all right, Dennis. Nothing can spoil my mood today. I've got some good news. Guess what? I've been promoted. I'm the new Deputy Assistant Supervisor of Sticky Tape. That's brilliant, dear. Yes, once I've done the Sticky Tape training course, it'll all be confirmed. I'm sure you'll do well. Oh, I hope so. There's one other thing, though. The new job's in a different part of the company, in Drano Town. What? Drano Town's a dump! Well, yeah, it's certainly too far to commute. We'll have to move. Move? We can't move! We like it here, don't we, Nasha? <laughs> and in Drano Town, we'll be able to afford a better house. But there's nothing wrong with this house. It's as solid as a rock. That'd be nice. Though we'd have to sell this one first. And, and another thing. What about Curly and Pieface? All me friends are here in Beano Town. Oh, don't be silly, Dennis. You can always make new friends. Anyway, dear, well done. Drano Town, here we come. Huh. We'll see about that. Enjoy your course. <gasps> oh, good news, Colonel. Dennis is moving. So I see. Well, it'll certainly make the job of the neighbourhood watch a lot easier. <laughs> I'll say. According to my calculations, we spend 89.6% of our time chasing Dennis. Indeed. But let's not count our chickens. Dennis is a Beano Town boy through and through. I don't think he's going to go quietly. <laughs> I'm just off to the shops, Dennis. OK, Mom. And remember, the estate agent will be bringing people to look at the house later. So just stay out of the way, OK? <laughs> Curly, alert Pie Face and get on over here. It's time for Operation Stay Put. Yeah, here we are. It's a nice, quiet neighbourhood, as you can see. Oh, I hope so. When I meditate, I must have the right vibrations. Ah, oh, yes. Perfect. This garden is speaking to me. It will be my peaceful sanctuary. <laughs> Okay, boys! One, two, three, four! <laughs> uh, but you did say you wanted uh, uh, vibrations. <laughs> <laughs> nice work, boys. She won't be moving in any time soon. Uh, garden's not bad. A bit tame for my liking. OK, hold your noses, everyone. Here goes one of me own patented extreme stinker stink bomb. <laughs> <laughs> you see, I like to get out in the fresh air and get back to nature. Oh, what's that? Ugh. <laughs> I'm sure it's, it's completely natural. <laughs> <laughs> So, Dennis is trying to put people off buying his house, is he? Time to mobilise the Neighbourhood Watch Welcome Committee. Now, as quickly as you can, deploy the sticky tape to create the perfect parcel. perfect. <laughs> <gasps> you know, I think I'm starting to get the hang of it. <gasps> oh, the kennel garden. Oh, she's scary. Yeah, but she's got one weakness. Her pet chihuahuas. <laughs> Yeah, this is it, Mrs. Uh, Barkington Wagstaff. I think you'll find it's uh, deceptively spacious. Well, it looks nice from the outside, but is there enough room for my little babies? <laughs> All right, 
smash it. Now! <laughs> You little fellows! Oh no! Not so fast, young chap. It's Walter and the Colonel. They're going to ruin everything. <laughs> Thank you so much. Don't mention it, madam. It's what the neighborhood watch is for, isn't it, Colonel? Of course. We always like to look out for our little doggy friends. Even monsters like that one? Oh, don't worry about him, madam. He'll be gone when they move. Hmm, I see. Well, with dog-loving neighbours like you, this might be just the house for us. <laughs> Shall we have a look inside? Don't worry, Den. We'll come and visit you in Drano Town. That's not even funny, Pie Face. No, it's not. And anyway, I'm not beaten yet. I'll think of something. I'm just calling your father. Oh, hello, dear. How's the course going? Oh, uh, quite well, I think. Marvellous. So what time will you be back? About four o'clock. I am looking forward to coming home. Me too, dear. See you later. Oh. Dad will be back at four. He's looking forward to coming home. We've got to do something to convince Dad to stay here, Nasha. But what? <laughs> Hang on. Mum says he's looking forward to coming home. Maybe if he got a really big welcome back, he wouldn't want to leave. <laughs> yeah, we could sing a song and, and put a banner up and... No, wait. I've got an even better idea. The kennel warden likes the house, Nasha. She's coming to look at it again at four o'clock. But I'm going to make sure she doesn't buy it. I've got a foolproof plan. <laughs> Just as I thought, Walter's fallen for it. Red alert, Colonel! The kennel warden's looking at Dennis's house again! At four o'clock! Excellent news, Walter! Yes, but the trouble is, Dennis is planning to put her off! Don't worry, Walter. He's not the only one with a plan. We'll make sure she stays and Dennis goes. Four o'clock! That'll be her! Right then. Neighbourhood Watch Welcome Committee, quick march! Just as I thought, Nasha, Walter and the Colonel are pulling out all the stops. Welcome, Committee, roll out, red carpet! What a lovely cake! A red carpet, too! Oh. <laughs> Hi, Dad! Welcome home! Hello, son. How have you been? You know what, Dennis? I was already having second thoughts about that job. And now, to come home to a welcome like this... Well, how could we possibly live anywhere else? Result! Well, sticky tape's not all it's cracked up to be. And let's face it, I'm a rubber band man at heart. You don't mind not moving, do you? Of course not. If you're happy to stay here, so am I. No place like home, eh, Dad? Exactly, son. There's no place like home.
joke shop. Yes, stay away from it. Do something sensible for a change. All right. I'll take Nasha for a nice walk. <laughs> to the joke shop! <laughs> Hi, Mr Ha Ha! Dennis, good to see you again. You too. So, what's new? Ah, vampire chattery teeth. <laughs> With a difference. <laughs> Added bad breath. <laughs> cool. <laughs> oh, hello, Mother. Oh, yes, Mother. No, Mother. Oh, of course, Mother. What's wrong? My mother, she's flying into Beano Town this morning, which means she's going to find out I run a joke shop. So, what's the problem? When she gave me money to set up a business, she thought I was a... vet. If she finds out the truth, I'll have to close down. <gasps> close the shop? No! I'm afraid so. Unless... <gasps> we turn this shop into a vet for the day! You mean... Play a trick on my mother? <laughs> well, well, I mean, that would be... Fun? <laughs> Curly, get pie face and get down to Mr Ha Ha's. We've got an emergency. Mother, quick, hide! <laughs> Mother! Hello, Hardy. Uh, welcome to my practice. Uh, how, how was your journey? The flight was bumpy, the taxi was smelly. This is it? Yes? You don't seem very busy. Uh, I'm expecting my assistant to bring in a patient any second. That's us! Come on, Nasha! Ah, there you are. And who is this little fellow? Uh, uh, Nasha. And what seems to be the problem? Uh, uh, pointy arrowitis. Ah, yes. Pop him on the table. Surely there's no hope. Shouldn't you just put him out of his misery? <laughs> Let's see. Uh, mallet, a clamp. <laughs> Mr. Ha Ha, I think we need an anaesthetic. Let us begin. Uh, Mother, you'd better sit down. Uh, tweezers. Check. Lights. Check. Dramatic music. Check. Then I'm going in. Ooh. That's one. Oh, yeah. And a, there. Oh, oh. Oh. Last one. It's going to be tricky. <gasps> Don't lose it now, Doctor. Now to wrap up. There. Right as rain. <laughs> further treatment, won't he? D oh, yes. Yes, say in a, a week or two. Well done, Hardy. You've saved him. <sighs> <sighs> Psst. We've got a problem, Den. Look outside. <laughs> 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 
Uh, oops. Uh, uh, we're closed. Closed? Oh, do your job, Hardy. Save these poor animals now. Oh, yes, Mother. Um... Telescope. Telesco telescope? Hmm. Uh, he's cross-eyed. Hey! Uh, he's suffering from uh, the concentric pupils. We've got just the thing. I think he might have, uh, um... Uh, low... Low... volume? Low volume... maximosis! Exactly! Uh, he's lost his voice. Try this, Mr. Ha Ha! <laughs> Molly what a cracker! Molly what a cracker! Next! Mm. Thermometer! Oh, of course. Uh, thermometer. Classic case of nippy rodent syndrome, wouldn't you say, Mr. Ha Ha? Oh, definitely. Yes, a, a very bad chill. No problem. This will warm him up. I'm very proud of you, Hardy. Now, give me a tour of Beano Town so I can show off my clever son. Oh, yes, Mother. Dennis, help! Dr. Ha Ha, what about our vet school? Vets in training! Uh, that's us! Oh, yes, eager to learn. More school? <gasps> Hardy, you've got little apprentices. You're so dedicated. Go. Teach. <clears throat> Oops. And who is this? I'm the local vet, and I've been getting a lot of dissatisfied customers. Uh, ah. May I suggest, Mr. Ha Ha, that you stick to what you know. Go back to running a joke shop. I can't believe my ears. A joke shop? Can this really be true, Hardy? You run a joke shop? But it's the best shop in town, Mrs. Ha Ha. My favourite. Please don't be angry. Fooling you was my idea. Angry? I'm shocked. Hardy Ha Ha, you always said you wanted to be a vet. Mother, that was when I was five. But can you honestly say that you're happy? Larking about in a joke shop? We're all happy in the shop, Mrs. Ha Ha, aren't we? Oh, oh yes. yes! I suppose if you're happy, that's all that really matters. Well, don't just stand there gawping. Show me everything! <laughs> Results! Oh, well, if you'd like to come this way, Mother, here we have a drawer full of fake doggy doodles. <laughs> That's always a winner. Uh, of course, the obligatory wigs, hats, itching powder, whoopee cushions. <laughs> 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 Popularity rock in a bag. Oh, it's a winner. <laughs> oh, dear. God, it's hilarious. Dennis, I thought I told you to stay away from this joke shop. But, Mum... Oh, please don't be too hard on him. Boys will be boys and they all like a joke. And some of these things are quite amusing. <laughs> Very amusing, in fact. <laughs> <laughs> for them to do the park up. It's got to be the most amazing park in the world! Yeah, imagine all the brilliant slides and roundabouts you could build in a year! Yeah, 
Maybe they've got water slides and... and a roller coaster! Yay! <laughs> Hang on! Where's all the fun stuff? Where's my roller coaster? Maybe the play park's been moved because it's so big and great. Ah, well, we're here now. Might as well make the best of it. Hooray! On me head, pie face! I got it, I got it! Come on this way! Hey, over to me! Oi, you lot! Can't you see the sign? No ball games! We're just playing, mister. I'm not going to win Park of the Year with scruffs like you around. We're just having a bit of fun. I said no ball games. Ah, no one messes with Parky Bowls. Cooey, Dennis! Isn't it lovely, Dennis? Look at these daisies be picked for me. Daisies? Please! <gasps> This is just lovely, isn't it? <laughs> Fancy a game, Dennis? Don't push your luck. Chess in the park. Rally the troops! Fire cannons! Boy, what's your game? No cannons in the park! Didn't you see the sign? But I've been doing these historical reenactments for years. Everyone likes the Colonel's battles. Yes, it's a park tradition. Are those park daisies, madam? Oh, um, um... No battles! I'm not having it! Now clear off, or I'll have the law on the lot of you. Go on! You've not heard the last of this, you horrid little man. What a rotten day this has turned into. That rotten parky has ruined the place. Dennis, look! Hey, things are looking up. <laughs> it's all the old park stuff. The parky dumped it all. How could he? My favourite swing. Here's that dent from when I fell on the slide. They look like giant dinosaur bones, don't they, Nasha? <laughs> Dinosaur bones! Hey, that gives me an idea! Come on, lads! Maybe we'll get our great day in the park after all! Whoa, it's taken all day. Well, that's the last of it, Dennis. Good! Just time to get to the park before it closes. Now, will you tell us what you're up to? Absolutely! Nasha, would you do the honours? <laughs> <gasps> it's a <gasps> Oh my! <gasps> it's a pond monster! <gasps> <gasps> <laughs> Got him! Hardest turn, boys! <gasps> this can't happen! Not on the first day! Oh, oh, here, get back! Here! Can't you see the signs? <laughs> <laughs> That's fixed him! Full speed ahead! <gasps> are all about. Come on, lads. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let's have that football game we've waited a year for. Right then, time for kick-off. Did you see the monster, young man? Monster? Uh... Oh, hang on. There's Walter and Parky Bowles. Walter, how does it feel to be the only one with actual pictures of the monster? I just want to help science in any way I can. 
Parky Bowls. A whole year working on the park, and now everyone just wants to see the monster. Will this affect your chance of winning Park of the Year? Oh, yes, absolutely. I put my life and soul into this park. You've said you believe the monster is a hoax. Is that right? Of course it's a hoax. Come on, lads. Park is getting suspicious. Let's go. How could a giant monster exist in a pond this size without us all knowing about it, eh? Mark my words, this is the work of rival park keepers trying to spoil my park. The park's worse than ever now. Yes. Thought that with that monster scaring everyone away, I could have my Waterloo reenactment. Now all these monster hunters are here. If only that monster would come back and scare them off again. Um, I don't think that's very likely, Colonel. What's that? Well, we built the monster to show that rotten parky. You built it? Well done. Serves him right, too. Yeah, but, um, <clears throat> we crashed it in the trees. Crashed, eh? Well, we just need to mount a salvage operation, then, eh? Oh, what? Where is it? Ooh, it's freezing out here. Here ah! I am, being blended into that bush for 40 minutes. Oh, well, why didn't you see? Well, it's my personal best in blending. <laughs> Right, lads, let's get kitted out. We'll soon have this Hulk rescued from the ocean floor. What's all this stuff? Scuba gear from my Navy days. Special ops. But the monster's stuck in the trees. It's still in the water, though, isn't it? Plus, you can't have a salvage operation without scuba gear. It wouldn't be right. Why has mine got a palm tree on it? Yes. Well, uh, blending in again, you see. Never know when you'll need to hide in the palm trees. So you didn't just get the stuff on holiday, then? Uh, let's get this monster back out of the water, shall we? Now, I know all about animals, and if there was a pond monster, it'd be a lot smaller, not the size of a whale. I've no doubt this is a ruse by jealous park keepers. Eh, trying to trash my lovely park. Is Parky Bowls right, or are we walking into the jaws of a giant monster? Let's find out. Jeff, get the winch. <laughs> <laughs> It's too heavy. We'll never get it back in the water. Ah! We've got a bite, viewers. Good. We'll soon have evidence to expose these rotten hoaxes. Gosh, looks like you were right, Parky Bowls. It is a hoax. Deliberate sabotage, as I thought. Of course, I wasn't scared. A monster that size couldn't exist. There's simply not enough for it to eat in our pond. That was close. Come on, lads. Let's get out of here. You're right, Nasha. We've lost the Colonel. Yeah, you see? This is clearly a slide. Uh, these are swing chains. And... What's that? As I was saying, it's just a hunk of metal. Real monsters are green and slimy, aren't they? <laughs> and for something to survive on the fish in this pond, as I said, it'd have to be much smaller. How much smaller, exactly? Well, I suppose about the size of a man. Hang on! Over there! There's something in the bushes! This tin can doesn't even have flippers! <laughs> you mean flippers like those? <laughs> yes! Exactly like that! <laughs> ah! A monster! <laughs> <laughs> Stay away from Beano Town Park! There are real live monsters here! Stay away from Beano Town Park! Leg it! <laughs> I see. How about helping a chap out with his mask, eh? Got stuck in those weeds. <laughs> Looks like we've got our park back. And we don't need slides and swings to have fun here either. No, indeed. <laughs> Oh, that mangy cur scared the life out of me. Come here, you hairy little wretch. <laughs> it might look like a 
like a pile of junk now, but it'll soon be the best BMX course ever. We'll build it right over there. Hang on, what's that? Party don't start till this afternoon. Eh? Who's party? Oh, Athena. I might have guessed. It's my summer party, Dennis. Didn't you get the invitation? Was it in a glittery pink envelope? Like, yes. Lavender scented. Nasher ate it. <sighs> Everyone got one. Uh, I thought it was junk mail. I dropped a pie on mine, and then Nasher ate it too. Well, you were all invited to come and see me mix with A-list supermodels and it girls. And DJ Crazy will be laying down some banging tunes. Yes! It's going to be the Beano Town event of the year! That's tough, because we're building a BMX Assault Course Challenge right here, right now. What? You can't! We can! No! I forbid it! You can't do BMXing near my party! Just you try and stop us! This means war, Dennis! to Athena's party? No a chance, Walter. Oh, phew. Thank goodness. I wouldn't want you lowering the tone. <laughs> oh, that hammering is so annoying! Oh, so lovely to be invited to a proper grown-up party. You're very early, Walter. I thought you might need some help to get the party going. <laughs> So, I bought you a CD of Mongolian throat singing. <laughs> Thank you, Walter. Perfect. This'll drown out Dennis. What's that howling? Is someone hurt? Oh. It's not us, Den. What she makes of this. The Din Makers full blast all the way up to 11. <laughs> ha! You can't get rid of us that easily, Athena. <sighs> should be doing this, Athena. Health and safety, you know. Ugh. Who cares? I have a balloon crisis! Get blowing! Oh, wait you are. Pipe is scary. 
hurry. Oh, I need pie to calm me down. That's better. How long do we have to stay at this party, Keisha? Until the little hand points to the twelve, I think. We better be the only glamorous, good-looking people there. Oh, that must be it. Hello? Is this the party? Sorry, this is an exclusive event. <laughs> exclusive? That's my middle name. <laughs> This music! Shit punk crash car! You'll have to change it. And we'll need canopies. And some spectacular entertainment. I don't think so. But oh, nobody says no to us. We're a list. list. Like we care. <sighs> this is strictly for BMXs. <laughs> <laughs> What 
What's this? Sold out? The Rat Bucket concert? It can't be sold out! Not anymore! <laughs> It's sold out. You let them in? But it was sold out, then it wasn't, now it is again. OK. Oh, but it took us weeks to get the money. Yeah, it's hard work washing all those cars. I'm having to dirty them up first. <laughs> come on, I've got a plan. We didn't want to come in anyway. Huh? I thought we did. <laughs> we have come to cook fuzzy rockstar. Oh, straight through on your left. Yeah, result. Oh, am I glad to see you. Right, I need all this food picked up for the after-show party. But I'll let you back in when the concert's over, OK? Oh, through there. Is that Rat Bucket's legendary 25-string guitar? Oh, can I see? Oh. <laughs> Out! And don't come back! OK, not a tunnel, but, uh... Hey, you know the way sheep get everywhere? Well, if we got ourselves some giant sheepskins... Parky's on to us. We need something he can't argue with. Like I say, a sheep. Hello, boys. Look what I've got. Oh, hi, Athena. Two VIP backstage passes. <laughs> it pays to be Rat Bucket's daughter. Well, if you've got two, who's the other one for? Miss Miniwoof, of course. Because she's a special wiggle person who likes her own special wiggle part. <laughs> anyway, must fly. Can't miss a minute. <laughs> See you, boys. One backstage pass, three people and a dog. <gasps> yeah, that'll work. <laughs> wow! So this is backstage. Maybe we'll meet Rat Bucket. Calling feet, calling feet. Turn left. Left pie face. Pie face! Leave the food alone! To keep my strength up, Dan. <laughs> You're really heavy. We're trying to get to a concert, remember? Ooh, he looks like someone important. <laughs> Hi. Ah! I'm Athena, my dad's rat bucket. Oh, uh, uh, hi, Athena. <laughs> ah! No, 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 darling. It's not polite. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Oh, my tummy rumbling. I need to eat. Uh, right. Have a sausage. <laughs> oh, gross! <laughs> Great. Now we're a tall bloke with a dog's head. Huh, very convincing. That. You made it. Whoa, like the new hair. Quick, Nasher, take these! <gasps> Rat Bucket, our local celebrity. Can I have your autograph? Uh, my wife's a great fan. Um, uh, uh, yes, you can. Sure, I'll sign this piece of paper with my left hand. Oh, 
Thank you. Now I need to go to my dressing room to, uh, dress. Wow! This is the real thing. Just... Just a minute. The crowd's been waiting quite a long time, that. I'd like some more food first. Oh, OK. Those pies are nice. You OK, Rat? Your voice sounds a bit... Something for your throat? Uh, more pies would be good. <laughs> oh, we haven't got time for pies, Pie Face. we got to get out of here. Daddy, hi. Hmm? I'm hungry. I need you to buy me some caviar. <laughs> That's not very polite. Just when Daddy's going to give us some money. Aren't you, Daddy? <laughs> Quiet. <laughs> Athena's talking. Oh, Daddy, can we go Athena have <laughs> some money? Is it? But you always give me money. <laughs> <gasps> You're not my dad. You're an imposter. Security! Quick, now's our chance. <laughs> You're needed on stage, Rat. Uh, uh, uh. Hey, but I'm the real Rat Bucket. I was delayed, man. Get my daughter Athena. She'll tell you. Huh. She's the one who told us there was an imposter about. <laughs> Real rat bucket. <laughs> I spotted you a mile off, mate. <laughs> You're not tall enough for a start. The band haven't turned up. You're going to have to do a solo gig. Rat bucket! Rat bucket! Rat bucket! Mr. Rat Bucket, sir, uh, uh, just caught the imposter. Uh, of course, he didn't have your star quality. That's him, is it? I'll give him a piece of my mind. How dare you? I'm sorry, Mr. Rat Bucket. It was stupid to pretend we were you. Consider yourself lucky I don't sue you. I'll tell you what, if you can get me in, you can be my personal guests for the gig. Oh, there you go, Mr. Rat Bucket, sir. He's oh, even taller than I thought. And then they pelted us with fruit. Oh, I love it when they do that. <laughs> <gasps> now, where's my band? They haven't turned up. Oh, man, they're always doing that. Hey, you don't know anyone who happens to play, do you? Uh, we play, but we're not very good. We know all your albums. Uh, but we can't sing. Yeah, everyone thinks we're rubbish, but we're really loud. Hang on, not very good. Can't sing. Really loud. Sounds perfect. <laughs> Hello, Beano Town! Please welcome Beano Town's loudest band, the Din Makers! <laughs> 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 